the DJ Tiny, Tiny Travel Channel, Tiny Travel Channel. <sighs> What's up guys? So this year's event is definitely harder than last year's, even though it's shorter. At least the, the breaks that we've been getting have been harder. And uh, last night I had a little breakdown. I kind of was, was thinking maybe I'm done. I was upset because we thought we had the parts sorted out and once we got them they were not the correct parts for the bike so we weren't able to get the bike fixed last night and just you know I am one of the most optimistic out there but I took one too many hits yesterday and you know it wears on you you get a little mental fatigue and you get sad and I was upset because I love to ride and I want to ride for you guys. I want to get content for you guys. Everyone's been so supportive and I just feel bad that I'm not able to get out there and get some riding in. But, you know, after a night's sleep, today was a new day. You know, everything's going to be okay. It's not the end of the world, but man, I hate that I couldn't ride today. I was in the car again today. We tried to source some parts. Um, Shout out to my friends at Vesper Marietta. They were even trying to get a flight to come bring me stuff at this stop, and it just didn't work out. Um, I have my friends from Memphis. The Memphis Kings were trying to find parts. I think they still are. They're coming in here pretty soon to support us. But if we don't get it fixed tonight, I will definitely have parts tomorrow in Rome. Uh, thanks to Vesper Marietta. Thank you guys so much. They're going to bring me some parts there. So, you know, it's just life. Things happen. Um, you try and be as positive as you can. And you guys know I always am. But, man, if I learn some things, it's keep your bike stock. You don't need, you know, I thought I needed all this stuff. And you learn something every cannonball. Uh, and this one I've learned that I need more knowledge about how to repair some things. And keep your bike pretty much stock. Uh, I was kicking butt the first couple of days, but that stuff failed. It just, it didn't hold up. So uh, the next cannonball will be more prepared. I thought we were more prepared this time. We'll be even more prepared next time, but physically I'm okay. Mentally I'm doing better. Um, thank you to Serena and Angela. They've been so supportive. Um, and you guys have been very supportive. So I'm sorry I've been able to post, you know, I lost my phone, I have this backup now. So we're going to hang out tonight. Something magical might happen tonight, you never know. Uh, everyone's trying to find me parts, so I might get what I need. But uh, I had a variator failure and I had a clutch failure. So I need to replace both. And uh, it's been kind of challenging finding parts. So we're gonna keep trying, but either way, I will ride into Hilton Head. I hate that I haven't been able to do more of the event, but I will ride into Hilton Head, I promise you. If I have to push that thing into Hilton Head, I will be on the back of it. So stay tuned, guys. I really love you. I really appreciate your support. You know, the cannonball. Bunch of people, Mary Mary, who's a good friend of mine. I think her engine blew up today, so she's probably out. So. I'm not the only one. We got a lot of bikes on the trailer. I think there's like five or six on there right now. So this has been a tough one. So stay tuned. Uh, I'm gonna post some more stuff this evening. Uh, I have some stuff from earlier that I'll get out to you. And I love you guys, I really do. And I appreciate you. So Tiny Travel Channel, Scooter Cannonball, it's a beast. Peace.